Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying three of the Roca Thins. These were the only ones that we saw. Uh, they were at Kroger for $3.99 each, so they're not cheap, but I think I'm very hopeful they're going to be excellent because we tried the um, the regular little Roca, Roca bars for yeah. the first time, and they were amazing. Really? And we tried the regular mocha, uh, Roca and the peppermint mm -hmm. in the same video. Very good. And they, yeah, they're just outstanding toffee. So I can't wait to try these thins. I have milk chocolate. And I have dark chocolate and dark chocolate peppermint bark. Okay, we're gonna try the milk chocolate first because that's the plainest. Um, you want to weigh them? It says bite-sized <clears throat> thins of milk chocolate with butter crunch toffee. I mean, it just sounds amazing if you like chocolate and toffee. We are going to weigh these for you uh, just to see how much you get for the calories. It says 1.4 ounces or 40, 40 grams, grams, 40 is, grams is 220 calories. More accurate when you do the grams. How big are they? Oh, they're pretty good sized chunks. Yeah, they are. I'm going to guess you need about... Because that's like half a candy bar. I'm going to say three of those. That's literally half a candy bar. I'm going to be off. It's gonna be like more closer to four. Yeah, so 20, 26. We're picking small pieces out. Oh well, no, they're all there's uh, they're, you're 39 right now. Oh, and it's 40? Yeah. Okay, so that's about that's it. That's probably about it. So So you get You get about five of these the size piece. Honestly, probably a good size candy yeah, bar. Yeah, that's not actually too bad. I yeah, it's a candy bar for 220 calories. Just think of it that way. Now, it tastes just like the, the little bars, except Fantastic. a little more chocolatey. Fantastic. A little more chocolate mm -hmm. in this version. Mm -hmm. It's excellent. Mm. Love that. Mm. Okay. Their toffee's a little different than... So we don't need to weigh anymore. No. They're all 40 ounces. Yeah, they're all going to be Two about ounces. the size of a candy bar. How much was yours? Um, 220. Okay, the dark chocolate's 210. And the peppermint's only two, but they're all the same um, size. Okay. 40 ounces. That's interesting. So you want to try the dark chocolate milk? Dark chocolate. You immediately get dark chocolate smell, literally. Yep. <laughs> and these are small. They look, they're about the size of a piece of fudge. Same thing as the one we just tried, but. Pump them. Yes. Little, like, one inch squares. Yes. That's good, but you don't, get that, you don't get that Roca flavor, the, the toffee mm -mm. flavor. You don't get it. At all. Mm -mm. The chocolate, the dark chocolate is so, so, so bitter and strong that it overpowers uh, any of that toffee in it at now, all. Now, see, I don't think that chocolate's too bitter. I do. Or too, it, and that's weird because I don't like dark chocolate that much. I actually think that's a nice dark chocolate. But you can't taste the toffee at all. I think I'm. I think it's incorporating the toffee into the dark chocolate, and, and for me, it's muting it a little mm -hmm. bit. You like that? I, I mean, that I would pick that. The milk chocolate's by far the best one. And it but. says it's just semi-sweet chocolate, which um, Jennifer is over in England, and she said, "What would semi-sweet chocolate be in England? It's just n nice dark chocolate. That's all semi-sweet chocolate is." Yeah, it, um, well, it's not a super I dark. It's it just a regular dark. I looked it up and it's just a regular dark chocolate. Yeah. So I don't know why they say probably a sixty percent, sixty six or something percent dark. Maybe. As a matter of fact, the article I read said because I was wondering too. I said, "Well, then what's the difference between semi sweet and dark?" And they said, "Really, it's very hard to tell the difference. That yeah. they're about the same thing. If you buy a package of semi sweet, package of dark, can't really tell the difference." Okay, so this is bite sized thins of dark chocolate with peppermint oh, yeah. candy. And boy, you smell the peppermint. Mmm. Good peppermint bark. It has a crisp to it. Mm -hmm. that, those other two were not like that. They were soft. That's good. I didn't get much peppermint in that, but it, it's good. I good did. creamy chocolate. There are pieces like mixed all in. You can kind of see a white piece right there. But it's not all through it. It's really, it's really more chocolate than anything. Isn't it? I'm sure 
the chocolate, that dark chocolate, semi-sweet chocolate, is the same as this dark chocolate. For me, though, it didn't bother me with the peppermint because, for me, that peppermint was strong enough to come through. It's not hard to taste it still is. At all. You still get that dark <laughs> chocolate, but no maybe it was just the piece I got. Yeah, because there are pieces in here that have more stuff in it. More than other. others. Yeah, you're going to get that with anything. There are some pieces in here that literally look like just pieces of chocolate with nothing in them. Right. So, well, I will. I'll take pictures of these so we don't have to close. Yeah, I'll take pictures of these and have them at the end. My favorite is milk. milk. Yeah, I pick that the original. Yeah. If you're gonna spend four dollars on a bag of this, yeah, um, get that. Unless you really, really like dark chocolate, then you might really right. like these. But that. But that's just the best. know it's dark. Yeah. So uh, thanks for watching.